Hey guys, welcome to another Gaging Gadgets review video. In this video, we have the Turtle Beach Stealth 600 Gen 2 wireless headsets. So this is a fairly new product from Turtle Beach and it does come in different varieties. They have one for PlayStation, PS4 and PS5, and then they have an Xbox version that works on the Xbox One as well as the new Xbox Series X and S. These feature a design on the earmuff that is glasses friendly. So if you wear glasses, these are probably for you. They also have 15 hours of battery life and they include what's called superhuman hearing. So if you play a lot of games where you need to hear things around you, these are gonna be perfect for you. You'll be able to hear all these little details within the sound around you, maybe a player sneaking up on you, things like that. All that for around $99 on Amazon, so check the link in the description to find that price. Let's go ahead and open it up and check it out. So it comes in a nice robust cardboard box, so if you're giving this as a gift, it'll look very impressive. And full disclosure, before we dig into the Stealth 600 Gen 2s, Turtle Beach did send these to me for free so that I would provide an honest review. Thank you, Turtle Beach, for doing that. All right, so on top right here, we have some literature. This includes information about the headset and also how to connect it to your PS4 and control it. Set that to the side real quick. We have the headphones right here. Let's see what else is in the box. Looks like we have a Type-C USB charging cable. And as you can see, it has a nice Turtle Beach logo on it. This is a very nice cable, very thick, seems high quality. And then you have a dongle right here that you will plug into your PS4 in order to connect the headphones wirelessly to your PS4. It's not too big. Nice Turtle Beach logo and then an indicator light so you know it's connected. That's gonna be all that's in the box. In the little literature packet here, you get a support card, warranty information, a quick start guide, and then a Turtle Beach sticker, which is always cool. All right, let's take a closer look at the Stealth 600 Gen 2s here. Right off the bat, they seem lighter than I was expecting. As you can see, this does have a nice blue ring around it. That's gonna be the color on the PS4 version. If you get the Xbox version, this will be green. These have a similar design to the Stealth 700 Gen 2s. Taking a closer look at the earmuffs here, as you can see, it's a very soft foam material. Provides a lot of cushion, and this hole is big enough to fit all the way around your ear. And I love the Turtle Beach logos inside the earmuffs, just looks really cool. Now the earmuffs do turn, so you can lay it flat down if you're gonna fit it in a backpack. And they also turn inwards as well, so it can fit around your head or on one ear, things like that. The earmuffs are also on a suspension that allows them to tilt up and down. And this can be really good for allowing it to fit on your head without any discomfort or pressure applied in one area, always like that. And then each side also is adjustable. And this has a very smooth adjustment right here. It doesn't feel cheap at all. There's no plastic cracking. And they do have some measurements. You can always get the perfect measurement to fit your head. And it stays there pretty good as well. Going up to the headband, we have a nice Turtle Beach logo. And this has a very nice sturdy plastic feel to it. The letters are indented, so this will not scratch off or anything like that. And then we have a soft cushion that is leather on the headband right here. Taking a closer look at the earmuffs here, on the right earmuff you have no controls or connectors, nothing really, but on the left is where you have everything. So we start with the microphone, and as you can see, it just articulates down. It also has the ability to be turned inwards, so get a little closer to your mouth if you need to talk quietly, things like that. And this does have two different places where the microphone stops. So at the all the way at the bottom, this is where it is turned on, and you'll be able to use it. And if you tilt it up like this, it gets out of your way and it also will mute the microphone. So if you need to eat or you need to mute your microphone real quick, all you need to do is just push your mic up and it's muted, very nice. It also does not stick out too far when it's up in place, so you don't have to worry about it getting snagged on anything. After that, we have LED indicator for letting you know the status of the connection or if they're on or off, a Type-C connector, the power button, a mode button, which will cycle through different equalizers built into the headset. So maybe you want stronger bass or you want higher vocals, things like that, you can go through those. You have the mic monitoring level, so you can change that on the fly. You wanna make sure you sound good, maybe you're live streaming. And then you have the headset volume right here. So you can turn it up, turn it down. Very easy to find that on the back of the headset when you're wearing them. So that's gonna be really it for the look and the design of the Stealth 600 Gen 2s. I'll go ahead and get them connected to my PS4 and then we'll do some testing from there. All right, so just to show you how easy it is to set up the Stealth 600 Gen 2s with your PS4, all you need to do is plug the little dongle into the USB ports on the front of your PS4. Then when it's blinking blue, that means it's ready to connect. Now all we need to do is hold down the power button on the headsets for about five seconds. 
the headsets will turn on. And then you'll see them sync up right here. Now this is currently red because the microphone is muted. So if I open up the microphone, you'll see it turn blue. And now we're connected and you can use the headset with your PS4. All right, so as you can see, I'm currently wearing the Turtle Beach Stealth 600 Gen 2s, and all the audio you're hearing is coming from the microphone on the headset right here. One cool thing about these headphones is you can actually plug the dongle into your computer, I have a Windows 10 computer, and use them just like you would any other gaming headset. So the microphone and the speakers on the headset work exactly the same as they would with your PS4, but on your computer. Hopefully this gives you a good idea of the microphone quality if you're going to be using for in-game chat or even live streaming with Twitch or YouTube. YouTube, something like that. This also shows you how they look when they're being worn. In my opinion, very nice looking headsets with the accented colors on the side, the microphone not too big where it's covering your face, and it just has kind of like a lower profile where they don't look oversized and they look pretty cool. All right, so as you just heard, the microphone on the Stealth 600 Gen 2s is actually really high quality, and I think it's definitely good enough for in-game chat or talking with your friends, but you could also use it as your microphone for live streaming on Twitch or recording YouTube videos, different things like that. Very impressed with the microphone. My voice came through very clearly, and there was no hiss or static in the background, so these are great. Now, the audio with these is also very impressive, very high quality. The lows and the bass comes through very clearly with no distortion, and the high highs have no tinniness, so it's a very good overall listening experience. You do have the ability on the headset to use the mode button to cycle through four different equalizer modes, and I found that they basically all sound very similar. The bass does go up with some of them, but the first one, which is signature sound, sounded the best to me, and I found it to be useful with basically all environments and games. It's also very easy to turn on superhuman hearing, with the power button, you just double tap it and it turns it on and that just brings up all the detail in the audio so you can hear people walking around you or gunshots off in the distance depending on what game you're playing. And the button placement makes it very easy to turn that on and off while you're wearing it in game with no issues. You can also change the volume, turn off your mic monitoring if you're getting some background noise or something you wanna be able to listen around you very quickly. I had no issues with the buttons here at all. Now when it comes to comfort while wearing the Stealth 600, I had no issues with pain or discomfort at all with the earmuffs here. Even though they don't have a memory foam like the Stealth 700s, this cushion right here is extremely soft and it kind of just cups around your ear. It's very soft in your head. There's no pressure applied to your head, but they also are not loose, so they're not like falling off your head. The headband cushion is soft, so no issues on the top of my head. And then the adjustment is also very well made and it stays where you put it. Now, when compared to other wireless headsets I've used and tested in the past, these are also much lighter weight. So I didn't have any pain in my neck after wearing them, which I have had with other Turtle Beach wireless headsets in the past. They were a little bit heavier and I just had some pain in my neck after wearing them for around like three or four hours, but nothing from these. The advertised battery life is about 15 hours with these. Now that is dependent on your volume, but if you have that at a moderate volume, you'll have no problem reaching 15 hours. Charging them is also very easy with the Type-C connector and plugging the USB cable into the front of your PS4. I found it really easy to just charge the headsets while I was using the speaker on my TV rather than the headset, and then they would be fully charged whenever I wanted to use them. From a connectivity standpoint, I found that the range between the dongle and the headset was around 30 feet, even with walls between you, so you can get up and walk around your house and listen to music or talk to your friends with no issues. While I was using these, I never heard any static or had any interference, so very happy with that. And pairing the headset with the dongle was also very easy, and there were no issues. Now they are advertised as glasses friendly. The way that works is the earmuffs have a little dimple where the glasses would sit so that they don't apply pressure to the glasses onto your head when you're wearing them. That's just a quick explanation of how that works. So overall with the comfort, the battery life, and then the different features that are available such as superhuman hearing or the equalizer modes and the ability to use these with your computer, I would highly recommend the Turtle Beach Stealth 600 Gen 2s. I think for the price of $100, they are great headsets with awesome audio and the microphone works good. So if you wanna do streaming or record videos, you'll have no issues with that at all. If you have any questions about these headsets, leave a comment below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. I'm going to add an Amazon affiliate link to the description below so you can find these exact headphones on Amazon. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up and please consider subscribing to my channel, Gaging Gadgets, for more gadget reviews and tech tutorials. Thank you so much for watching.